basal ground cover transect. What is that? So, in the basal ground cover transect, we're looking at ground cover. So, it's really an assessment of bare earth um, and how much you've got in your field and then other plants that are covering it. So, you're looking at forbs, grasses, legumes. Um, so, in this test, we walk a 60 metre transect, which is a straight line starting at your sample location, and you take a post, so an electric fencing post, and you put it down at 60 centimetre intervals at each point on the transect and you record exactly what the post hits. So if it's bare soil, you put in bare soil, but if, if you're going to record grasses or legumes or any other plant, it's got to touch the stem of the plant. So you're actually looking at where the plant goes into the soil and not the canopy, so not the leaves. Um, so it gives you a true idea of what the ground cover actually is and not the canopy. And that's what basil means ground cover rather than canopy cover of the plants. So we're starting at our sample point and we've just put the fence post into the earth and we're looking now to see what it's touching. Is it bare soil um, or grass or another plant? So what do you reckon? So that's gone in straight into the bare soil. Okay. The, the gap in the soil. So I'm going to go to the basal ground cover transect test and I'm going to select bare ground in the options and then I'm going to do save. So then we need to do the next one at 60 centimetres um, in front. So if we're doing our transect that way, we're going to walk 60 metres from our sample location. So I've got a ruler here. At 60 centimetres, there's two lengths of this ruler. Um, so this is a sort of rough measurement so that we know how long it is. Um, but in this instance, we can actually use Ed's foot because it is about 30 centimetres. So we're going to take a measurement at every two feet. So this is our second measurement which we put in on the same um, test, basal ground cover transect. And here, what do you think we've got? We are on a legume. So here we've actually got a legume, so I'm going to put in legumes on the app and do save. <laughs> 